Hey everybody, this is Arathas, and welcome to Fantasy General 2. So we're going to go straight into the next mission. We're going to go after the Sunken Lands. And yeah, chase down the Imperial Legion and the Transmuter that fled Krell's Landing. Because there can't be anything good that they're doing down here. The Sunken Lands is an area of Keldonia ravaged by a magical catastrophe that flooded the whole region and turned into a swampland filled with strange magic. Half of the Western Imperial Legion went on an expedition into the Sunken Lands, and you will try and confront them before they can return to Krell's Landing. Let's do it. Have we found enough boats for our warriors? We need to set sail soon if we're to catch the Imperials off guard. We've taken every fishing boat and merchant's vessels we could find. Our army has boarded and is ready to leave port. Fallerson, do you have a moment to spare? What is it, Tyr? We're busy with our preparations and the fleet is about to sail. I cannot come with you. What? You mean to leave us? Why? This is her homeland, and she's weak. I told you when we first met that the trolls will die without their root tree. Mine was felled a long time ago, and I've spent a lot of my lifeblood fighting at your side and calling on the spirits. I am spent, and I feel my bones weakening. I'm not going to live much longer. How can this be? The other trolls don't seem to be affected. Are you sure? My brethren still have their root trees that renew their life force. Every time I spoke to the spirits to help us, I spent a little bit of mine, and I have nothing left. Without my root tree, I cannot regenerate that life. My time has come, and I want to return to my woods to see them one last time and die in peace. Aw, I like you though, Tyr. But I'm not going to keep you from going. That's, that's completely understandable. Will you free me from my oath to fight at your side? Yes. Yeah. You'll be missed, but yeah, it's the right thing to do. You have been a brave and loyal companion, and I was proud to stand by your side. You have done more than enough to pay back our help. You were freed from your oath. Thank you, Fallerson. Thank you in the name of my people for defending our lands from the Empire and saving our root trees. The spirits smile on you, great chieftain, and I know you were blessed by them to ride to many a victory. I am glad I have met you, Ailsa. I know my knowledge is in good hands. Now let me go and die in peace so I can be a tear quiet earth again and face my end with a calm mind. I, I'll miss you. I don't know if I can face this war without you. You have grown much in the spirit realm, and I'm sure your light will shine strongly. You will be your people's guide in the days to come, and my people need someone to be their voice and counsel. I trust you will be that voice. Aw, thank you. You are the bridge between. You connect the world of the spirits and the living, of trolls and humans. Without you, they would be separated. You do not need me for what lies ahead. You honor me, and still I will miss you dearly. Go in peace, Tyr. I will see you in the next world. You will be sorely missed here by all of us. We have been through much together, and you will always be remembered. I am not one for long goodbyes, but I will miss you too, Grayskin. May you find your peace, lass. I thank you all for your kind words. I can leave this world in peace now, knowing you will look after our lands and our kin. I will send Harg and his brothers with you to help you in your war. Their arms are strong and they are brave souls. Who's Harg? That's Harg. Oh. Goodbye and may the spirits watch over all of you. I will see you in the next life. Man, that makes me sad. I like Tyr. And she was useful. But it would be wrong, like, if we're just going strict, like, story stuff and role-playing and all that. It would be wrong to keep her here. She did all the work, and see her name already changed from Tear Angry Earth. It switched back to Quiet Earth. It'd be wrong. She's weakening. She wants to go to her home and die peacefully in her home. Yeah, right thing. Let her go. Goodbye, Tear. Thank you for everything. Well then, we don't have time to tarry any longer. We must set sail while the winds favor us. So did we get another troll charger or did we get another, is it a charger, armored troll, whatever. Or did we get another boulder thrower? Chieftain, we've landed, but the winds have pushed some of the boats off course. Our army has been scattered. Damn it. We have to bring our warriors together again. We've never been to these shores and we do not know what dangers the sunken lands hold. This is a strange place. I can't sense the spirits here. It is confusing. And it reeks. There are some foul winds here, all right. When the cataclysm struck the land, the magic that Krell collected was scattered through the land. It surely will affect your spirit sight. 
It was a terribly powerful explosion when Krell's tower fell. Are you Krell? You sound as if you were there. My eyes have seen many things and many times. Now you're just trying to mess with us. Eyes can't see into the past. No matter. We need to be concerned with the present. We have to find the Imperial Army and the transmuter leading it and stop whatever they have planned. I still do not know what they want here and that vexes me. We do not have time to ponder. Sound the horns and call our warriors to my side. We'll attack the Imperials and get to the heart of the matter soon enough. All right, so. Yeah, so we start on the water there. Oh, Harg and Targ. So it's another boulder thrower. Oh, that's going to be dangerous. It says he can be upgraded too, but he looks exactly like our siege troll. So, okay. <laughs> What's our other deployment zone? Uh-huh. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put... I'm going to put all of our trolls on this side. And... The wolf mother... And Ulnar the bear. And then I need to give him some troops. Let's give him all of our, like, berserker types. That'll do. And over here we'll put our... Uh, shield-bearing melee fighters in the front. Fallerson... Elsa, Dougal, the Thane. All of our archers, which of which we have a lot. Oh, I'm not even going to be able to deploy everybody. You know what? You could use a scout as well. There we go. What the f What's that? Bone Golem. Oh. Oh no. Oh, we we started around that settlement. Holy crap. Alright, let's look at uh Hark and Targ and see what they can upgrade to. Oh, okay, so they are a normal troll hurler, not a siege troll. But look at all the resources we got. We can cover this. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's pretty. All right. Start smacking these dudes. Okay. I was hoping for a bit more. And apparently I'm going to get a bit more. Well, if I could get, if I could have gotten you into there, that would have been perfect. Oh, wow. We can do a lot of damage to a bone golem. But okay, then. I'm going to send these guys this way to get this settlement. Yeah, you guys come this way. Do I have anybody that can move just straight up into that town? No. That sucks. My own fault, but it still sucks. I don't see a whole lot over here. Other than a camp I would like to explore. These swamps look eerie and they smell worse. I can readily believe them cursed. Many died here. A part of their spirits still linger. The land has not been cursed, but some terrible magic has struck it, changed it. It still reeks from every part of the swamp. 
And it also gets my boots soggy. This is much worse than the bogs at home. I cannot think anyone would go here voluntarily. We have no choice but to cross the sunken lands, but stay watchful. These waters are treacherous and lizard folk have made the lands their home. They can hide in the dark pools easily and we don't want to be caught in an ambush. Uh, no, 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 we really don't. I thought that was something I could explore. It's like, why have I not? Okay, Harg and Targ also need an artifact, I think. Honestly, magic damage reduction, probably a good idea. All right, here we go. Al. Don't be a dick. Holy crap. Found a transmuter. I shouldn't burn these to the ground. I need to use them to replenish losses. I'm very happy I came this way, though. We got a transmuter right up in our face already. And a legion on its way. A very big undead legion. Eey. Not sure how I feel about that. We need to get out of the bloody water. It's hurting us terribly. Upside is, if I can get all my dudes on land... Oh, what the... Aha! I am the one who will ambush. <laughs> oh, wow, really? I mean, sure, let's go. Wolf Mother is not going that far forward. Thank you very much. Dragon Bones. Oh, I'll look for some more Dragon Bones. That's for sure. Hmm. Okay, we need to get out of the water. So I can kill some of these undead SOBs. Ooh, I don't like that. You won't be able to kill him, huh? But I think you... Ooh. That's going to be expense. Oh, oh no. Uh oh, <laughs> this is not great for anyone involved. Unless I can get you here. Oh, I can. Cool. Kill that thing. Then you can fall back. And I can restore the squad. That's why I don't want to destroy that building. I need to I need to be able to restore. Yeah, this is a pretty big problem. Like our troops are caught on the beaches and I can't really break through. Even Fallerson is not in a great position to do that. Uh, 
I might lose this unit. Except I can fortify. Even if he is in the river. This won't do anything. Uh. Yeah, this is not a great matchup for us. I made some errors, I should say. Hmm. Do I have any magical abilities? Can I summon some mercenaries? I can, but I don't think they'll be super useful. Right? Well, actually. I can put some of them right there. And some wolf killers right there. And that will bolster our forces in the short term, I hope. <laughs> I really hope. Transmuter receives reinforcements. Not fair, dude. Not fair. <laughs> I mean, it's perfectly fair, but still. Yeah, see, the silver wolves are expendable. Hmm. Silver wolves are doing a good job of absorbing damage. Oh, and of course, you guys are going to stop me from advancing. Son of a... <laughs> I knew it was coming, but damn. Let's do this. I'm worried about what might be lurking in these trees. Okay, you can rest. But that's why this dude's going to come down here. Everybody hit these dudes. All right, bring the bats down. Well, that sucks. I don't think I can pull him out. I think all I can do is just keep doing what I'm doing in the hopes of breaking a hole in their lines. Ah, this is a brutal fight. I'm not going to lie. Like, I'm in real danger of losing both of my heavy axemen. my glorious heavy axeman. <laughs> Aha, flesh walkers. Seen you dudes before. Not a fan. So we're just going to throw some long distance rocks at you <laughs> and hope for the best. Wait. Yeah, I can move you. Okay. Crap, I should have kept Dougal in the area. But that still got him out of the uh, line of fire. I can live with that.
and they are going to go after the mercenaries. Good, good, good. Thank you so much. I know it's weird to thank the enemy, but in this situation, they really did me a favor. There's two transmuters. Okay, we'll be able to tear through this now. That's dangerous. Did you just summon more? He summoned more of the bats. I don't think this game is aware of just how much I hate those bats. <laughs> but either way, with this, unfortunately, I am all out of time for today. So thank you, everybody, so very much for watching. And if you enjoyed this video at all, then please, by all means, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, or any combination of those actions that suits you today. But with that, I'll see you guys next time for some more Fantasy General 2.